let's go for a ride! You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today! Cycle Cruiser videos brought to you at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Three things that you should never leave your house without before going to ride your motorcycle. Number one, your gear. That's a given. But let me tell you this, guys. I know there have been riders before that have actually said oh shit I'm just going up to the store real quick or I'm going down the street to my buddy's house I don't need my helmet fuck it they jump on their bike and they fucking uh they well it happened to this one motor vlogger by the way I I'm not going to mention his name but you guys may know he was in his parking lot of his his apartment he said oh fuck he's just going to the he was going to move his bike in the parking lot or something and something happened and he fell off his bike and jacked his face up <laughs> I don't know how the fuck he did that but it can happen guys I mean you can just say say to yourself hey you're just going down the street or going to get to the store up the street big deal you'll be alright no problem nope it's usually instances like that that you end up having a fucked up day that you least expect it so always wear your gear all the time number two always leave home with some money but I'll tell you this guys take like 20 bucks and just put it in the trunk of your motorcycle and just leave it there because it happened to me a couple of times where I ran out of the house without my wallet and I'm running low on gas I'm not thinking you know, I just automatically assume I got my wallet with me and I go down and check what my, my wallet's not there I'm like oh shit but thank God that I keep some money in my truck. You know, otherwise you're going to be calling a tow service or your buddies or something to help you get some gas. Or you're going to be walking your bike on the side of the road here to the next gas station. Which, if, you, if you're riding out in the country, that could be a long walk. <laughs> you know, also you want to bring your cell phone. So actually it's four things. You definitely want to bring your cell phone so in case you run out of gas and you don't have any money, you can call somebody to pick your sorry ass up. Uh, also, bring your tire repair kit. Uh, if you don't have one, I'll include a link in the description and comment section of this video to the one I have. It's fairly inexpensive. Keep it with you, man. Put it in the trunk of your bike. It, if it doesn't fit, get you a tail bag and just leave it in the tail bag on the back of your bike so that way you don't forget it because I'll tell you guys happened to me one time I got a fucking bolt in the back of my tire a fucking bolt man You know, usually if you get a nail, you can ride out with it and just keep it in there until you get home. But I had a fucking bolt, so it kept me from being able to ride my bike on the street. I had to pull over in the parking lot. I pulled that bolt out. I didn't have an entire repair kit. I didn't bring my freaking cell phone to call for help. And uh, I said, fuck it. And I ended up riding home on, on, on a flat tire. I rode really slow when I went through the park because it has virtually very li little traffic in our park system here in Ohio, here at the uh, in Cleveland, Ohio, in the metro parks. So, which I know is not a good thing because you can bend your rim. So, you definitely don't want to do that. Luckily, I didn't have any problem with my rim, and uh, but I definitely wouldn't advise riding on a uh, a flat tire. But if you had that tire repair kit, I could put the plug in. And I'd be good to go, probably take me less than 15 minutes. So you definitely want to carry those items with you. Uh, because it can happen to any of us at any time. 
you never know but you definitely want to have those emergency items with you guys I know there's other things you can carry but those are really the most important items especially your cell phone and uh, and carry some money in the trunk of your bike most definitely man because you never know like I said uh, it, it happens to the best of us but hey guys that's all I have for you uh, as you guys know I know a lot of you guys ask me about all the gear that I'm wearing and stuff I always include links to all of my gear in the description and comment section of the videos uh, so you can check that that kind of reduces the comments and uh, but that's all I have for if you want to see more of my videos I have a bunch of playlists over at cyclecruiser.com click on my videos uh, Hit thumbs up if you like this video. Subscribe to my All of My Motorcycle channel. I appreciate all you guys. Take care. Stay safe. And we'll see you later. Deuces. Welcome to Psycho Cruises Click the Go links. Just click on the pictures below to go to my recommended videos and my social media sites. Also, don't forget to visit my blog and store at cyclecruiser.com. If you have any trouble clicking on these links, they are also provided in the info section of this video. Thank you and subscribe today. Guys, check out my new channel where I talk about anything and everything, not just motorcycle related. Psycho Cruiser Motor Vlog.